welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be a DIY for Halloween. How to do this crash, which on your door, wall, wherever it is you want to put the wreath on. It's really easy, really quick. Only dollar items except the legs. I will tell you where I got the legs, but you can definitely find legs. Which legs at the dollar store? Let's get to uh, let's get to doing it. Uh, da, 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 da. Got stuck. <laughs> let's get to doing it right now. Remember to subscribe if you haven't done so. And if you already did, thank you very much. Click the bell to notify you when I have a new video. Click the description box to see all the links to the good places to go, like my Facebook and my Instagram and my online shop. Rather than that, let's get to doing the read. Welcome. The items that are that you're going to need to do this fun. Uh, a Halloween wreath will be the following. You're going to need your wreath form or whatever they call it, wreath form. I barely noticed this one's broken, but it doesn't matter. You need a wreath form. Of course, this is from the Dollar Tree. You can use anything really. If they have the wood one, you can use that one as well. And then you're going to need one of these Halloween rainbow skirts. I did got this one at the 99 cent store, uh, but you can use anything you want. And I didn't even see this was all splattered. You're going to need this little cute little hat. This is from the Dollar Tree. It's just one of those plastic little hats. And you're going to need some witch legs. I did. I did bought this one from um, Safeway, but the Dollar Tree also has um, some legs as well. They're not as sturdy as this are, but um, you are able to find them at the dollar store. I got this. These were on sale. When I got them, I got them from $2 and something. They're the Witch Leg Yard Stacks. Stakes. Um, they have the sticks right here. And they're really sturdy. The ones from the dollar store are a bit smaller and a bit flimsier. But you're able to do just fine with either one. And um, you're going to need your handy dandy hot glue gun and hot glue. Um, you can put other decorations as well. The main purpose is to make the, uh, the witch that <laughs> she got... She, what do you call it, stuck witch on the wall or like crash, there we go, crash witch on the wall. You can add other uh, decorations like a cat or any other boots or anything else that you really like. But other than that, we're going to go ahead and get started to do this craft right away. I really am really mad that I didn't see that it was dirty, but what to do, right? So let's get started and making our handy dandy cute little uh crush my witch fell, my my. forgot to mention you would also need these halloween mesh ribbon i did got this at the 99 cent store but you can get it as well at the dollar store i'm not sure if they would have um this kind that has this like literary thing but um we're gonna see if we need it um but let's see, let's get started. We have our skirt over here. So now we're trying to make uh, our skirt look like it's the witch's skirt and that it's stuck. I'm not gonna use it the other way around because it'll look funny and it looks kind of weird on the other side. So we're gonna use the shinier side on the other side and I'm going to use the carver that it comes uh, on with and I'm going to hot glue that to the form over here
I have stuck the legs now and I put them a little bit one slanted from the other one so it looks like she's like struggling to get out. Now I'm just gonna cut glue the little hat that I have here and I'm gonna put it on the opposite way, on the opposite foot that um, it's moving down so it's visible. And that's pretty much it. I'm going to hang it with a wreath hanger like this that you can also find at the dollar store look now it's stuck and that's basically all you can put a little sign you can pretty much do everything or decorate it with anything you like you can add a little cat but i think now the little cat would be a little bit too much but other than that that is all that you can do for the crashed um witch wreath and that is the final look of the crashed on the wall, crash on your door, witch wreath. Everything that you see here is really affordable. I had it the other way around a minute ago with the legs the other way. It looked a little bit funny. It looked cute. But like you get you don't get to see the details on the witch's little boots here but other than that it looks like she actually crashed the little hat over here i actually had to secure it with a safety pin i don't know if you can see that to i don't know more hot glue it if you will if you want to but i think the safety pin is better if you get one of those you can easily put something else there but other than that that is all for today's video hopefully you enjoyed this little um DIY really quick you saw it was really quick really easy and yeah subscribe if you haven't done so and if you already did thank you very much and I will see you next time happy Halloween bye bye <laughs> it looks pretty cool from the side look at that she's totally crashed she has my legs though <laughs>